Hi folks, welcome to another Insulation Stop video. This video is for our pipe wrap insulation. We offer two different types, a linear pipe wrap and a spiral pipe wrap. Spiral comes in two inch wide, four inch wide, or six inch wide. And the linear pipe wrap comes in six inch wide and is included with an adhesive strip. Let me show you how to install them. Folks, this is a three quarter inch copper pipe, which uses a two inch pipe wrap insulation, so we won't demonstrate the four or six inch. And it's easier to cut into manageable strips. This is actually about eight feet of pipe wrap. So I've taped down the, the copper pipe here, and we'll start the uh, spiral process. You wanna leave about a half inch overlap as you wrap the pipe. This will give you an R4 insulation value as a pipe wrap application. The four and six inch spiral pipe wrap is used for larger width pipes and also for condensation on drain pipes. And you'll start again with another eight foot or manageable length to complete the pipe wrap install. And it's always nice to tape off wherever you start and stop and makes insulation a lot easier. The linear pipe wrap is different than the spiral pipe wrap. It's foil to one side, white to the other side, and it includes a adhesive strip to make insulation a breeze. The six inch wide lineal pipe wrap is excellent for a three quarter, half inch, or one inch copper pipe. Good to tack down the end. And I like to work in manageable lengths. This is probably three and a half feet. This also gives you an R4 thermal rating for wrapping your pipes. It doesn't have to be perfect, folks, as long as you make a good seam and the entire pipe is wrapped. And that is the lineal pipe wrap, sold in six inch widths. And both forms of pipe wrap will give you the same thermal performance. Your insulation will necessitate whether